With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, today's question is if the solution of the differential equation dy by dx is equal to x minus y upon x plus y is x plus y whole square is equal to c plus ax square then a is. So let us start with the solution. We have to find the solution for this given, uh, this given differential equation solution is given and we have to find the value for a. So dy by dx is equal to x minus y upon x plus y here let let us put the value for y equal to vx and let us differentiate with this respect to x so on differentiating this we will get dy by dx this will become v plus x and dv by dx now we got the value of dy by dx as this. So let us put this value in this equation. So this equation will become v plus x dv by dx is equal to here also instead of y we are going to put here vx. So it will become x minus vx upon x plus vx. Now if you take out x common from numerator and denominator so they both will get cancelled x in numerator and denominator so we will be left with here we will be left with 1 minus v upon 1 plus v and here v plus x dv upon dx or the value for x dv upon dx will be equal to 1 minus v upon 1 plus v minus v we have just taken this v this side so that all the terms having v are on the same side right now we are going to take here lcm so this thing will become 1 minus v minus v minus v square divided by 1 plus v this is equal to x dv upon dx so this will be equal to this will become minus v square minus 2v plus 1 upon 1 plus v this is the value for x dv upon dx now let us take uh, do cross multiplication here so this will become v plus 1 upon and here let us take out minus common so when we take out minus common this will come down also and minus this will become plus v square plus v minus 1 now here we will get dv and here we will get 1 by x dx okay so what we have done we have just taken out minus from this thing so we have taken out minus common and we have done cross multiplication so that dv will come with the v terms and x dx will come together now we are going to integrate both the sides so for that let us put the value for v square plus 2v minus 1 equal to t now differentiating this we get 2v plus 2 dv equal to dt right now here if we take out 2 common we get v plus 1 equal uh, here d, dv equal to dt so from here the value for v plus 1 dv will be equal to dt by 2 now we will put this value in this above equation the equation so that equation will become minus here in place of v plus 1 we will put there this thing in v plus 1 dv we will, we will put there dt by 2 so it will become dt by 2 and in the denominator we were having v square plus 2v minus 1 so that we have to equal to t so we will write here t and that is equal to this side we were having integration of dx upon x now we can integrate this easily so this will become minus 1 by 2 constant out so here we will get its integration as log t and here 1 by x integration will be log x then plus log c now we will put back the value of t 
so we took t as v square plus 2v minus 1 so we are putting it back here so it will become 1 by 2 log here we will have v square plus 2v minus 1 equal to log this will become log xc because we know we know that log a plus log b is equal to log of a b so with this property of log we can write it like this now what we will have here see this is one more property we know of log that a log b is equal to log of b to the power a so now anything which is written in front of log can be written uh, to its power right here so this will become using this property this will become log v square plus 2v minus 1 to the power minus 1 by 2 equal to log of xc so this implies this log and this log will go so it get cancelled so we get here a v square plus 2v minus 1 to the power minus 1 by 2 this is 1 equal to xc now we are going to put back the value of v so we are going to put back v is equal to y by x so this will become y square upon x square plus 2y by x minus 1 to the power minus 1 by 2 equal to xc now we will take its lcm so in the denominator we will have x square and here we will have y square here 2xy and here x square and its power is minus 1 by 2 and here xc now we are going to do reciprocal of this right so when we do its reciprocal we will get here x square upon y square minus x square plus 2xy and this negative power will become positive by doing reciprocal here and here xc now this is what technically this is what this is under root of x square and also here under root so when x square will come out of root so we will have in the numerator x and in the denominator we will be having under root of y square minus x square plus 2xy equal to here also we are having x and then c so this x and this x will get cancelled now we can write this equal to under root y square minus x square plus 2xy equal to 1 by c and then we will put this 1 by c equal to c dash right so let 1 by c equal to c dash now now we are going to do squaring both the sides so this will become y square minus x square plus 2xy equal to c dash square so we will uh, say that let c dash square equal to k so this will be equal to k now this will become y square minus x square plus 2xy equal to k so this is the solution for the given differential equation also we were already given one solution in terms of a so we can compare both these solutions so the given solution which we had before that comparing that before that comparing we will do here plus x square and minus x square so here doing plus x square and minus x square this will become y square plus uh, 2xy minus x square plus x square minus x square see this was already there then plus x square and minus x square equal to k so this will become x plus y whole square minus 2x square equal to k see this this and this will make x plus y whole square and then i minus x square minus x square will give us minus 2x square equal to k or we can write it like this also or x plus y square is equal to 2x square plus k this is the equation this is the solution 
for the given differential equation now we are going to compare this compare this with x plus y square is equal to c plus ax square so basically we have to find the value for a so this is resembling this this c is constant this a is also constant this is x square x square so the coefficient of x square will be the value for a so therefore we can say that a is equal to 2 so this is the required answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today